Hello and welcome to a video that brings incredible news about Social Security and the potential for $1,400 stimulus checks for seniors. In this video, we're diving deep into the latest developments that have the power to transform the lives of millions of older Americans. But that's not all. We'll explore the pressing issues surrounding Social Security, inflation, overpayments, and the intense congressional battle. What makes this video even more captivating is the choice we're about to discuss. Should funds earmarked for foreign aid be redirected to support struggling seniors right here in the United States? We'll break down the numbers and the implications. This is a video that you won't want to miss, so make sure you stick around till the end. And if you appreciate these regular updates on Social Security and the potential for crucial financial support, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below and stay informed with the latest news and insights. Let's get started. The idea of providing a one-time $1,400 stimulus check to seniors on Social Security has gained significant traction, and its timing couldn't be more crucial. Inflation rates have been on the rise, which poses a considerable challenge for seniors who rely on fixed incomes. The increasing cost of essentials such as housing, utilities, and groceries is putting immense financial pressure on older Americans. Therefore, the prospect of these stimulus checks offers a ray of hope providing them with some financial relief to cope with these escalating living costs. Adding to the financial woes of seniors, the Social Security Administration has encountered a significant issue with overpayments. The agency has disbursed over $20 billion in overpayments, which is a substantial amount that could have been directed to assist those dependent on Social Security. Seniors who have received these overpayments now find themselves in the predicament of how to repay these funds, further compounding their financial struggles. The ongoing battle over Social Security in Congress is reaching a critical juncture. Speaker Mike Johnson's advocacy for a deficit commission has set the stage for a fierce political battle, particularly concerning Medicare and Social Security. On one side, Democrats and progressive groups express concerns about Johnson's previous support for substantial entitlement cuts. On the other side, President Biden has vocally criticized Republicans for their desire to reduce these crucial programs. The sustainability of Medicare, Medicaid, and Social Security in their current form remains a topic of intense debate among experts. Mike Johnson's proposal to establish a bipartisan debt commission aims to address these financial challenges, but it's essential to note that the commission's recommendations won't see a vote until after the 2024 election. This timing could potentially create a disconnect between elected officials and their constituents' immediate needs. Regarding the $1,400 stimulus checks for seniors, there's an intriguing fiscal debate at hand. A substantial amount of money is being allocated for foreign aid, with billions directed to countries like Israel and Ukraine. This allocation raises the significant question of whether some of these funds could be redirected to support struggling Americans, particularly seniors reliant on Social Security. The notion of reallocating a portion of this foreign aid to provide $1,400 stimulus checks to the 66 million individuals on Social Security, at an approximate cost of $92.4 billion, raises a fundamental dilemma. Should the government prioritize the well-being of its own citizens over international aid efforts? In summary, these recent developments underscore the pressing issues surrounding Social Security and the potential stimulus checks for seniors. The choice between providing support to seniors in need and allocating funds for international purposes is a matter of substantial debate. Your input on this matter is invaluable, as it contributes to the ongoing national conversation on how best to assist those who rely on Social Security in these challenging times. Thank you for your continued interest in Social Security updates and for participating in this important dialogue. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more important updates like these. Stay informed and take care.